Hey guys, so today we're going to have a look at an acid base neutralization reaction and try and make some sherbet. Alright, so first off, what we need is icing sugar, we need whichever flavour you like, jelly crystals, bicarb soda, and citric acid. Okay, so the two important ingredients we have are our base and our acid. So what we've got for our base is we've got bicarb soda, which is a carbonate, which is a weak base, and we've also got citric acid. Now there's not actually that much, there's only a teaspoon of each of those, um, but all they do in this mixture is create the bubbly sensation, the fizziness that we want in our sherbet. The main ingredients for the actual taste, we've got two tablespoons of lime jelly and we've got three tablespoons of icing sugar. So in here we've got our icing sugar. We're going to add our jelly crystals. Mix those through. Then we're going to add in our bicarb soda. Okay, so that's just a teaspoon of that all the way in. And then our citric acid. Okay, so the reaction that creates the fizziness in the sherbet is an acid and a weak base, which in this case is carbonate, in our bicarbonate soda. The acid we're using is the citric acid. Okay, now when you add those two together, what you get is carbon dioxide, water and a salt. The salt we're creating is sodium citrate, so what we're doing here is we're going to have citric acid plus sodium bicarbonate goes to carbon dioxide, water, and sodium citrate. Okay, so what we've got there is C6H8O7 plus three sodium ions, hydrogen carbonate, three carbon dioxide plus three water plus C6H5O7 Sodium 3, so that's carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and sodium. Okay, and that one there creates our sodium citrates. Okay, so as we know, the fizziness that comes from the sherbet is actually the carbon dioxide. Now, this isn't currently fizzing, okay? What we're missing is the water in your mouth. So your saliva actually takes part in this reaction. It means that the, the bicarbonate and the citric acid can dissolve and they react more readily making more carbon dioxide available, which is why you feel the bubbles on your tongue. We've got our acid and we've got our base. Now when we put those together, mix it around. Let's add some water to that now. So that's what happens on your tongue with sherbet. That's carbon dioxide, water and a salt being formed. Okay, so we've got these guys here and they're going to help us figure out what ingredients we had. So, can you guys guess, and you can try it, what that one is? Acid. <laughs> Ooh, what these are you are the jelly crystals. I yeah, think. I think they're the jelly crystals, mate. So you would have been able to tell. See how bright they are? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Oh, now. Yeah, they do taste like jelly. Okay, Ooh, what should we give you next? How about this one? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Baking powder? That is, buddy. What do you reckon? Do you like it? You, you like it though? No. No? no. <laughs> no. no. Alright. Two to go. What do we have left? Ooh. Ooh, one of them's acid, acid, acid yeah, um, and the other one's sugar. Ooh, oh, yes, sugar, sugar. Which one is this one? Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> acid. Ah, acid. Good, I'm glad you got that. Ah, that's the sure. job. <laughs> and that one. Sugar. sugar. Excellent. Mm. Now, as you guys already know, the acid and the bicarbonate create the bubbles. So let's try some sherbet, yeah? Yeah. Right. Mm. What do you think? <laughs> so good. Tastes like sherbet? Does it fizz? Yeah. Awesome. Um. <laughs> All right, Odie, your go. What do you reckon, bud? It tastes like cream, but um, all bubbly in your mouth. Exactly. It tastes like 
cream with lemonade. Yeah, I, I get that. Yep, yeah, cool. Awesome. I just want to eat it. Oh, can I have more? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. <laughs> oh, it's green. I love it.